Hey guys, it's Owen here from Offit Automation. I'm here today to give you a quick rundown on the differences between a semi-automated 1D pallet shuttle, a 2D fully automated pallet shuttle and a 3D Moffat taxi system. We'll start off with the 1D semi-automated pallet shuttle. So the one directional shuttle is a semi-automated machine which means it needs an operator to use it. The operator lifts the shuttle with a forklift and sets it into the racking. This shuttle goes in two directions only, forward and backwards, and it's used with a remote control. This system is good for high density storage, low throughput, and with very little SKUs. The shuttle itself has a lift capacity of 1,500 kg, which is similar to the 2D and 3D shuttles, but it has its limitations. So moving on to the 2D shuttle and the 3D taxi solution, these are both completely different solutions in comparison with the 1D semi-automated solution. And the reason for this being is that this is a fully automated machine. So these machines work without any human interaction within the system. They work off a meshed Wi-Fi system to communicate to each other, to store pallets efficiently, take the most efficient route, get the pallets, and to ensure that you're running the most efficient warehousing solution possible. Um, the big difference between a 2D shuttle and a 3D taxi is that in a 2D shuttle solution, the shuttles stay on the same level at all times. So conveyors are used in and out of the elevators to move the pallets. The most flexible solution of all three is the 3D taxi solution. Um, and the reason for this being is that the taxi itself drives into the elevator to change levels. Um, one feature of both the 3D taxi and the 2D shuttle is that they can move in both orientations in comparison with the 1D semi-automated shuttle. So they can drive in this orientation, they can drive in this orientation, and in the 3D taxi solution, we can drive up and down between levels as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you found the topic of today's video interesting. Stay tuned for more demonstrations in the future.